is equal to 4. You'll be told to solve the following logarithmic equation. Log to base 5 for 125x is equal to 4. So how do you solve this? You can solve it by definition of a logarithm, isn't it? So by definition, you know that if you have x raised to the power a to be equal to b, then a is the index, x is the base, isn't it? B is the corresponding number. So the index is the log of the corresponding number to the given base. So it means this 5 is the base. Then you see our a. Our a is the index, meaning index is is 4, meaning 5 to the power 4 is equal to corresponding number 125x, isn't it? Then you know 5 to the power 4 is 625, so this one is 625 to be equal to 125x. So from there, you just divide both sides by 125 to get, to get x, isn't it? If you divide both sides by 125 to get x to be 5, isn't it? Is it that? But again, you can solve it using laws of logarithm. So laws of logarithm, this is how you do it. This is log to base 5. Meaning on the other side of the equation, you introduce log to base 5. And the only log you can introduce is log 5 to base 5. Meaning a log of a number to the same base is always 1. Isn't it? A log of a number to the same base is 1. Is one. So you now have the same base on both sides of the equation. So what you get rid of is that, is the coefficient, isn't it? Are you seeing that? So this form, which is the coefficient, it becomes the power, isn't it? So we end up with log to base 5 of 125x is equal to log to base 5 of 5 raised to power 4. Then you ignore log on both sides of the equation. Are you seeing that? Are we together? So when you ignore log on both sides of the equation, you remain with 125x is equal to 625. So you divide by 125, both sides to get your x is, is 5. So you can actually solve a logarithmic equation either by using the laws of logarithm or by definition, isn't it?